Are you ready, child of God? Because this is what is coming. Habakkuk 1.5 is a reminder word. I want you all to be reminded of this because the Lord is doing this in this hour. The more I go into um, our email account, the more I see testimonies, the more I know Habakkuk 1.5 <laughs> is real. And I can't wait to read the rest of all the testimonies that keep on coming. This is the hour, you all. I said it's the hour for the miraculous and it's the hour where, where men in the body of Christ will receive bountiful blessings, if not hundreds, then thousands of people. God is doing a work in our days, says Habakkuk 1.5, that even if we were told, we wouldn't believe. If you've missed out on the recent testimonies as well that I shared on, on the ministry, you might need to go back to the last three or last four live streams and, and the last recorded video to have a listen of what the Lord has been doing and is still doing for his children. So this is, this is exactly what is happening now and this is what is about to happen to many more. Habakkuk 1.5 is happening. This is the days and this is the times that Father God is speaking about. He's doing a work. He's doing a work that even if you were told, this is what I'm doing. Child, get ready, prepare, okay? Literally, the Lord wants you to be ready. The Lord wants you to be prepared. God wants to shock you and he wants to surprise you, yes. Well, he wants you to also be ready. So that, I mean, it's it's not too too much of a shock that you kind of like faint and be like, <gasps> but yes, okay. And also I released our own testimony yesterday of how we've been trying to get this document for Bibi Pearl. Um, according to the passport office, they, uh, you know, she had to have this document to be able to get her passport. It's a new law in the country where I am, and it was so challenging. It was so challenging, but God did it. That we got the uh, documentation um, the same day that we applied. It was stressful, but God did it. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The same day. And we were told that it was going to take about two weeks because she's a baby. It was like long, but it came out the same day. And I shared that testimony. Um, yeah, so there's there's actually just just been, you know, uh, financial blessings and money, little money miracles just appearing. And somebody uh, released a testimony about you know she receiving um, money, uh, uh, a miracle of financial blessing out of nowhere. She had no idea where it came from. Um, I think two people in the ministry so far, one last month and then one this month as well. Um, God is so good, and this is truly the days of Habakkuk 1.5, and this is what is literally about to happen. Habakkuk 1.5, what you never expected, what you, what you can never imagine. Ephesians 3.20 as well, this is that hour. So get ready, stay prepared, keep walking with the Lord, keep serving Him, keep loving Him, keep obeying Him. Hallelujah, keep being obedient, willing, and keep being humble, and He will come in to surprise you with rewards, and have faith in this hour, in Jesus' mighty holy name. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, thank you for your word. I pray, O oh Lord, that Habakkuk 1.5 becomes a living reality, a divine reality in your people's life. I pray that you will bless this word in their lives, Lord. And I pray that you will bring about miracles and bring about great things, Lord, upon your people. That you will be ultimately glorified, Lord, and that they will come to love you even more as their God and their Father. In Jesus' mighty name, may their faith come alive and may their hope be restored. To receive that thing that you promised them in Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. All right, you all I've got to go because baby Pearl is gonna say hello. You're gonna say hello, yes, say hi, <laughs> yeah, say hey, you man, go forward. What's up, yeah, hey, everybody, are you gonna pray for them? Yes, minister, yes, bless them, yes, yes, yeah, amen. Amen. Say bye bye. Say bye. <laughs> She's so hungry, you all. All right, you all. So I will see you in the next one. Remain encouraged and understand you are in the days of Habakkuk 1 5. This is exactly what is coming up next in your life. A surprise, something shocking, something wonderful. And also, you know what, you all, even the most recent testimony that we got. Everyone's always putting the word shocking in there like I was shocked. My doctor was shocked. I'm telling you all, the Lord will shock you in this hour. Remain encouraged and remain blessed in Jesus' name.